He's a changed man. You see? Since he became reacquainted with you, I mean. Well, he has shaved his beard. Interestingly, I wasn't speaking of his facial hair. What then? More his friendship with you. No more than a touch of warmth in the winter of his years. I've known him for some time. I never like this. You were a friend of his late daughter, I believe. And his late wife. Such a tragedy. Life does batter at us. But we must persevere with spirit for as long as we possibly can. It's a trick to staying young, don't you think? That's not a trick I seek. He speaks very highly of you, Mrs. Paul. Well, he speaks of you so rarely. I suppose we could say you're something of a ward to him. A friend, I like to think, who cares a great deal for his welfare. Sounds like a warning. Do you disapprove? Would it matter if I did? But of course. I hope to be welcome in your life, Vanessa. Then perhaps you should come and visit us at Grand Edge Place. In time. Thank you.